proof using double angle formula. These are found in the formula and tables book, page 15 and 14. I'm going to try to prove the second one here. I've done the first one in an earlier video. And I'm going to try to make the right hand side of this look like the left hand side. Step one, I'm going to exchange tan squared A for sine squared A over cos squared A. I now am going to multiply above and below by cos squared A. This gets rid of the denominator in both uh, these fractions. So when I do this, I get cos squared A. I get a cancellation here, giving me sine squared A being divided by cos squared A plus sine squared A. I'm almost at, almost at the solution now here. Cos squared A minus sine squared A is equal to cos 2A. This is in the formulas and tables book. So this is useful. It's what I want it to be equal to. And cos squared A plus sine squared A is equal to 1. So it's all been divided by 1. So I've proven the identity at this stage. Important learning in this example is it does not matter which side of the equation we manipulate to look like the other 